वेलकम बैक टू एम एल टी वर्ल्ड टूडे फ्रेंड्स आई एम गोइंग टू शेयर यू इन्फॉर्मेशन रिलेटेड टू एन टी सी सी पी टेस्ट वट इज एन टी सी सी पी टेस्ट फर्स्ट वी विल सी दैट वट इज द एब्रीवेशन ऑफ सी सी पी और सी सी पी स्टैंड फॉर सी सी पी स्टैंड फॉर एंटी साइक्लिक सिट्रोलिनेटेड पैप्टाइड टेस्ट दिस टेस्ट इज नेम्ड बाय सम अदर नेम्स ऑल्सो नॉन बाय सम अदर नेम्स दैट आर साइक्लिक सिट्रोलिनेटेड पैप्टाइड एंटीबॉडी टेस्ट साइक्लिक सॉरी सिट्रोलिन एंटीबॉडी टेस्ट एंड एंटी साइक्लिक सिट्रोलिनेटेड पैप्टाइड टेस्ट सो देर आर डिफरेंट नेम्स फॉर सेम टेस्ट एज फर्स्ट वी विल नो वट इज एंटी सी सी पी एंटीबॉडीज एज बाय नेम इट इज क्लियर दैट दीज आर एंटीबॉडीज बट these are called auto antibodies antibodies and auto antibodies both are protein in nature and made by our immune system but antibodies uh, that will be protect our body from bacteria viruses and all other foreign particles but auto antibodies attack our own healthy cells or tissues or organs that's why they are called auto antibodies and what is the target of these ccp antibodies they will target the joints tissues of the joints and they will target only healthy tissues in the joints if anti ccp found in the blood it means there is a sign of rheumatoid arthritis that is one of the autoimmune disease ccp antibodies are found only in the patients who have arthritis rheumatoid arthritis specially and they will not be found in the blood of patient who have sorry who don't have arthritis rheumatoid arthritis so only the patients who have rheumatoid arthritis anti ccp antibodies are found in the blood so we can understand the purpose of anti ccp test the our main purpose to check anti ccp antibodies to check the either patient have rheumatoid arthritis or not if anti ccp will be positive it means that this patient have rheumatoid arthritis anti ccp test is doing along with rheumatoid factor test if both test will be positive it indicates the uh, presence of rheumatoid arthritis but now studies most of the studies have shown that anti ccp test is more accurate uh, than the rheumatoid factor so that's why for the confirmation of rheumatoid arthritis doctors are mostly writing anti ccp test so what are the symptoms on that symptoms doctors will write this test first is joint pain then joint stiffness especially in the morning joint swelling and there will be a fatigue and there is also a low grade fever so these are the symptoms on which doctors on the base of these symptoms doctors will write uh, anti ccp test so what type of sample we need to perform the test A blood sample is needed to perform the test blood is collected from the vein of the patient and that is collected in clot activator tube that will be red or yellow cap tube and blood can be collected at any time there is no fasting sample required for this patient but one of the most important point is that if the patient is taking any medication like vitamin supplements or any type of uh, uh, specific uh, medicine they should inform doctor because uh, for this test Uh, some medicines are prohibited to take at least 8 hours before the test so they should not take any medicine at least before 8 hours of the test how we will interpret the result of the test that result will be either reported as negative or positive if negative it will be reported as less than 20 units but sometime uh, the range can be changed according to the lab and if positive it means more than 20 units if negative means it mean it shows that blood don't have uh, anti ccp antibodies but if it is positive it means that anti ccp antibodies are found in the blood and that is the sign of rheumatoid arthritis but as i told bo- uh, before that rheumatoid factor test also doing along with anti ccp test 
so how we will match these two tests with each other if anti-ccp test is positive and rheumatoid factor test also positive it indicates the uh, presence of uh, uh, rheumatoid arthritis disease but if anti-ccp test is positive but rheumatoid factor test is negative it means patient is in the early stage of rheumatoid arthritis and if anti-ccp test also negative and rheumatoid factor also negative it means that there is a less sign of rheumatoid arthritis and doctors need further investigation to confirm or to find out the cause of uh, patient's uh, pain in the joint or swelling in the joint if patient is suffering from the symptoms then doctors have to find out some other root cause for the disease maybe they are suffering from any other issue so anti-ccp test is as i told more confirmative test for the confirmation of rheumatoid arthritis that is one of the most common autoimmune disorder especially in the old ages so i hope you understand the um, uh, concept of anti-ccp test why we need this test and how we will read the result if you like this video please press like button write in comments also and do share and don't forget to subscribe the channel thank you so much